Okay, so let's do another one of these uh, Newman projection strain energy problems. So uh, this one says compare the total strain or compute the total strain energy of the following conformation um, using the values provided in the table. Show complete uh, show work for complete credit. So um, here we have what is this two three dimethyl butane. Uh, the problem doesn't ask you that, but uh, I have uh, built a model of the Newman projection that we're looking at. Remember, again, you can, and what we're doing here is looking at the rotation about the C2, C3 sigma bond there. So remember, it can freely rotate around. And if you look at this conformation, hopefully the first thing you see is that is a really strained conformation, okay? So the first thing I would say is if you're having a hard time seeing this, build the model, okay? You saw how long it took me to build the model. It wasn't that, that long, okay? But if you're cool with that, the next question I would have you ask yourself is, is this eclipsed or um, staggered? Eclipsed. It's eclipsed, okay? So remember, the Gauche interaction, that's only in the staggered conformation. So we can kind of eliminate that from our choice choices, okay? And then we just look for, okay, is there a hydrogen, hydrogen eclipsing? Do you all see one? Yeah, there's one, it's right here. That's what I would do and I would mark it, 4.0. And then hydrogen methyl eclipsing, no, I don't see one, but I see methyl methyl eclipsing, right? So a methyl methyl and a methyl methyl, they're both 11. And then it says we have to show our calculation. So we'll just say the strain energy that equals, well, there's one, two, two times 11.0 kilojoules per mole. Remember, we're still in chemistry, so we got to write our units. And then we're going to add that to 4.0 kilojoules per mole. Okay. Is there any questions about what we've done so far? Okay, good. So 2 times 11, that's 22, plus 4, that's 26, right? So 26.0 kilojoules per mole. And then box the thing so Professor Heath knows which one you want me to look at. Okay, good morning. It's nice to see you. Any questions about this one? Yeah, probably we went over all of them, all the questions from last time. Okay, cool. So that's how you do these things. Good luck doing them.